Now in this part of the question we've got to find out what the value of k is given that the sum of the first four terms of the sequence comes to 43. And what I've done here is from the parts a and b I've written down what the second term was, it was 2k minus 7 and in part b we had to find the third term which was 4k minus 21. So if we're given this result what we can say is that therefore the first term plus the second term plus the third term and the fourth term is going to come to 43. Now we know what the first term is, that was k. We know what the second term was, that was 2k minus 7, so I put 2k minus 7 in there. Third term, 4k minus 21, so put 4k minus 21. Now, when it comes to the fourth term, however, we've got to return to this recurrence formula. So for the fourth term, just set n equal to 3, and so we get twice a3, so we know what twice a3 is going to be, that's going to be twice 4k minus 21. And then we have to subtract 7. So this part here is the fourth term in the sequence and all of this lot equals 43. So all we need to do now is just expand out that last bracket so we'll just copy this down and if we expand this out we're going to get 8k and then two lots of minus 21 well that's minus 42 and we got the minus 7 equals 43. Simplify this just group together the k's and the constants and what you should find you get is 15k and then minus 77 and that equals the 43. At 77 to both sides you got 15k then equals 77 plus 43 which is 120. Divide both sides by 15 and then you get 120 over 15 which turns out to be 8. So there you go, k equals 8. And that brings us to the end now of this question.